bo jest słaby i taki w miarę łatwy do tego. No i Position from your ass to the yeah. back of your leg. Okay, good. Hello. 
hope. Uh, that would make you help because the baby should straight forward. Yeah. Yeah. Still keep it in balance. Because when stirs, it's happening in stirs. It's actually when it's born, it's better. Yeah. I talked to her. It twists around your ankle a bit. Okay. So you're actually walking in a position. It's helping a lot. So from this. From this position, you can shoot all the way up here. But then you have to go around. The Germaki. You go back. Here. You see? Yeah. And after that, you have to go that way. <laughs> I guess you could twist up like this, but you end up in a really awkward position. Yeah, and then I have no strength to draw my bow. Exactly, because you pull them actually with your hands. You have a many degrees through your body. You can apply this too. Move up here. You gotta strike to pull that. Hang on the wrong side. This is work when you shoot in the stairs to a certain level. I'm riding somewhere between show jumping and jockey. Yeah. Sitting more like this. Because you should be able to hang. Actually, on your knee, almost halfway down. Here, without getting the stirrups, uh, the foot lifting the stirrups. It's a pretty, uh, it's, it's a tough way to ride. But it has an advantage because most of the common riders are sitting on the ass. Meaning they have all the weight back here. And as soon as something happens, they will lose the stirrups. Pinch like this and then lose the stirrups. <laughs> but if you have the weight in your stirrups and this contact moves back, then the horse can do anything. Jump, defend. Do it. You like you saw me yesterday. He almost he fell in the corner. Mm. I was still standing, almost standing. <laughs> I was cry almost crashing from the saddle. But even with that, when I'm pinching with my leg, I got my fits in the stirrups still. Okay. With the long stirrups, I will lose them. So, What's happening also is when I got my uh, let's say gravity down here, instead of here, the horse can do anything. Rear it can buck, rear it can buck, and I was just standing like that. You can just sit like Yeah, I sit and go. Yeah. Pew, 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 pew. You see what's happening? What I mean? This is a really good foundation. This is also what you see in the military horseback archer. They're riding with these really short letters. But they, if you go to India, they are more like normal. Round saddles, it's flat, more flattened. Mongolians got very tight and standing higher up. It's the same, basically the same principle. But with a lower saddle, you have to work a lot with your muscles, spine and back. You have to try to support yourself. You know, it's, it's easy to end up in this position because you don't have any of those muscles. Try to first to move around, like from, from left to right, left to right. I think maybe if you jump back a bit, you don't need the support. But just hang on your side. Jump a little more. <laughs> okay. So, if you're turning now, you have to lean a bit forward. Because I'll show you first. I only have five. What are you talking about? We're even. I've got five as well. You see? can do it if you look at Kasa. All right. Let's see. He's actually hanging on the side of the horse. Uh, yes, yeah, so you can clearly see. Oh. But that works on a straight track. No curves whatsoever. If you want to shoot forward in a balanced position, you have to go up on this and lean a bit forward. Mm. Try to keep, still keep the balance on top of the horse. Okay. What? What? <laughs>